-hmm. Well, we all know this fact, seat belts save lives, and the students at Ridgeview High School in Nampa know that and so much more. Not only are they helping to spread the message to their peers, but they are also getting national recognition for their efforts. Take a look. Officer Hobson, we got Brady, we got Paige. It's great to have all three of you joining us today. And I want to know, why is buckling up so darn important to the Warhawks? Buckling up is a really big part of our Warhawk spirit here. Um, one thing that makes it really important to us is when it comes down to it, seatbelts save lives. And that that's pretty much it. We want to be as safe as we can and that's one easy, wonderful way to do it. Absolutely. And what are some ways that you guys are helping to raise awareness for seatbelt safety? So one thing that we do here at Ridgeview is we participate in the Idaho Battle of the Belts competition, which is a statewide competition where high schools um, put together a buckle, buckle up campaign through their school and in their communities. And so over the past few years, we've worked in the Battle of the Belts competition and also got had the opportunity to be a part of the National Organization for Youth Safety um, Seatbelt Save competition. and. Uh, been able to participate in those and it's really been a great way for us to be able to share the message out there and over the past four years we've really seen the growth in our community where the first year when we started the competition we only had 81 percent of students at Ridgey High School wearing their seatbelts but over the last four years this year we got all the way up to 95 percent which is a huge increase and so I mean we were all super stoked by those numbers and it's just really showing that our efforts are, are paying off and it's just it's really, really cool to see the, the benefit that it's having in our community. Yes, I mean, that's a lot to be proud of. And not only are you, you know, really gaining a lot of recognition and making an impact at Ridgeview High School where you're located, but you've also been able to step onto the national stage and you received some recognition and some awards. So tell us about the awards that you've received. So we did with the Battle of the Belts competition this last year. We um, won the, the statewide competition and it was really cool. We got to have a sweet ceremony at the Airhawk War, Warhawk Museum um, in Nampa, which was super cool to be a part of, a super cool experience. And we also have been recognized um, as the overall um, best campaign on the national level through the NOIS, which was super, super cool to be recognized on such a big stage. And it's just, it's cool to see, once again, just see our efforts paying off. Absolutely, that is so exciting. And, and you know, awards, they're great, but the overall goal here, right, is to make sure that students are buckling up. And so, Officer Hobson, help us understand how you're gauging your success in that regard. Well, so the program that we run is a month long and we started October 1st through November 1st. And prior to the beginning of the program, the students go out and we count every occupant or passenger coming onto our campus. And we look at whether they're wearing their seatbelt or not. And then we run our program and then we take the same survey at the end of it. And then we are able to compare the numbers. And so this year, uh, our seatbelt use compliance rate was 93% before we started and 95% when we finished. And I really think that 93%, uh, which is a great number, uh, really reflects how good this program has done over the last four years. So really great numbers and, and good to see these students working so hard to get people to buckle up. Yes, it's a marvelous impact that you've all been able to make not only in your high school, in your community, but also as you shared with us on the national stage. Thank you so much for all your efforts to help save lives. And you can learn more about how to be a safe driver at shift-idaho.org backslash buckleupidaho.